Today, we're going to demonstrate how simple it is to integrate Cisco Umbrella with your Meraki wireless networks. We're going to start in the Umbrella dashboard. On the left-hand side of the screen is a menu section, very similar to the Meraki dashboard. Scroll down to the Admin section and select API Keys. Click on Umbrella Network Devices and copy the key that has been generated for you. Once you have that API key, we are now ready to head over to the Meraki dashboard. Hover over Network Wide, and under the Configure section, click on General. Scroll down until you find the section titled Cisco Umbrella Account. Input the API key here, and then press Save Changes at the bottom. We are now ready to configure the Umbrella account. Hover over the Wireless tab, and under the Configure section, click SSIDs. Here you will find a list of all your current SSIDs. For this example, we're going to start off with our HQ Employee SSID. Hover over the Wireless tab, and under the Configure section again, click Firewall and Traffic Shaping. On this new page, scroll down until you get to the Block Applications and Content categories. Click on the Link Umbrella Policies button. This will pull all of your policies from Umbrella and bring them into the Meraki dashboard. Under the drop-down that appears, I will select our Employee Umbrella Policy, and then I will type in the box below all of the external domains that I want to exclude from Umbrella. Don't forget to press Save. Now, when we switch back over to the Umbrella dashboard, you will see the changes in identities reflected here. Our Employee Policy now has one identity, which is the SSID we just configured on the Meraki dashboard. 